Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Shirley, if you are new here. And if you are new, why not become a part of the family? And I wanna thank all my old subscribers and all my new subscribers. I'm so blessed to have you guys watch my video. Thank you. I'm gonna do a small, you uh, what is it called, haul. It's not Sephora haul, because I went to different stores when Sephora was having their sale. I only did like a rebuy, a re restock on the Sephora stuff. I purchased what I like on sale. And one of the rebuy was the Laura Mercier Deep, Medium Deep Potter. I really love this setting powder. And I've tried to find all different kinds. Like I tried the NYX, I didn't like it. It smelled funny to me. And then it makes the, makes the, whatever you put the powder, it turns dark. I really like this Laura Mercier. And I also purchased with it the little powder puff. This is so, make putting on the powder so easy. I really love that. And I, I purchased one before and I think it was around about Christmas time. And someone said that you can wash it. And I washed it. That did not work. No, it didn't work. So you can't wash. I get, I don't know. I didn't like the way it feel after you washed it. And I also purchased from Sephora the Long Lasting Makeup Setting Spray by Urban Decay. And I, I think that was, I saved like $14 on everything that I purchased from them. And then I purchased also this Fenty Beauty by Rihanna, the eyebrow pencil. I was gonna do Benefit, but since I saw this in Fenty, I said, let me give it a try to see is this something I want to add to my makeup routine? And I also repurchased the Sephora eyeliner in 01 matte and it's waterproof. And I also got and I also got 10 in brown black matte waterproof. I haven't tried any of them. Some of them I have opened, like I opened the powder. <laughs> And then I bought the Milk Eyeliner Emboss. And this one really lasts a while on your eyes. And what I like about it, it do not get on my contacts. I really love that. And those are the things that I repurchased or added from Sephora while the sale was going on. And I think I saved... I don't tell you how much you save, but everything cost me $82. So I saved five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, about 13 or $14 on the sale. And I know some people go in and buy big items and stuff. And I didn't try any of the new makeup because I want to get samples of them first before I buy those $68, $37 bottle of makeup foundation. And you, and this is for the month of August. You know that I purchased the Anastasia of Beverly Hills, the Jackie Anna palette. And you can see I've been using it. I really, really love this palette. I really love it. And I'm not just saying it because it's Jackie Anna. I love this palette. I love the colors. I love the different things you could do with it. I even did a makeup where a makeup tutorial. It's not a tutorial. I did a makeup video where I only use this palette on my entire face. And I'll put it somewhere up here. And I also bought a small palette from Sephora. It's the I Love Little palette that they have. It is in the medium warm eye palette. And that's how it looks. And then, you know, I said in my video when I did, uh, um, I hadn't purchased any palette from Anastasia of Beverly Hills before beside the Jackiana. And I was in Target, not Target. I was in TJ Maxx and I saw this palette by Anastasia. It's the Subculture. 
palette. And these are the colors in here. I, I really was getting it for like this one, the new wave and oh, this is called edge, not edges, but edge. I like these colors. That one, I don't know about that one. They look a little shimmery. But this is an old palette, and I know you guys have seen it everywhere, but it was only $19.99 at TJ Maxx. That was a deal because the palettes are usually like $45. And I also got the Olive Olay Night and Day Cream from um, TJ Maxx. And I got it because usually in Walmart, they cost $24 each. And I got them at TJ Maxx for $14.99 each so that was not one thing that i purchased and seem like i'm talking about a lot of makeup stuff so but i have hair stuff too to talk about and i bought these brushes these two brush this brush is from avon and this is the powder brush and it's so soft i really love avon brushes and then i bought the foundation brush from avon this I, this brush lasts and I really like that. And when you clean it, it just, it goes back to it original thing. It's just, I love this brush. And it's made it from synthetic fibers. And then I also bought the couple of the Real Technique brushes. This is a foundation brush. And then this one is just a buffing brush. But I love Technique brush also especially the buffing one. This is the one I put my makeup on. Like after I put, use that makeup to put it on my face, I use this to blend it. And I also bought a cream concealer from Avon. And it's, it's I don't know if you can see it. Can you? It's that color, but I didn't like it. I didn't use it. I don't, cause it just, I ain't like it. <laughs> I didn't like it. And then um, the last couple of items, I bought um, mascara from Avon. I haven't used this one yet either, but I like to have mascara on hand because you know, after six months, sometime when you're using it, it can irritate your eyes. So I wanted to give that one a try. And then I finished off my collection for my hair with the main choice, Tropical Moringa. This is a shampoo and conditioner that I'm going to do a video on using these, the Tropical Moringa collection on my hair for one month. And I want to see what different did it make in my hair. I want to see, did it grow? Did it retain the length and, and hair wasn't popping off? Because that's what it say. Help to support natural growth and retention. So I want to see, will it do that? And I'm going to be using all of the product in that line. And I also bought the hair mask to go along with that month long product use that I'm going to do. And that is all that I purchased in the month of August. And I keep saying, I'm not going to buy any more palettes, but I'm really not going to buy any more palettes because the colors don't go too, don't vary too much from each other. So I'm going to try to use all my palettes that I have in my makeup videos that I do because I do simple looks with my makeup. So that is the end of all the stuff that I bought in the month of August. And I hope that you enjoyed this video. And if you enjoyed it and you're new, become a part of the family. All you have to do is subscribe and hit that notification bell. For every time I upload a video, you get notified. And then comment and like the video. I will see you in my next video. Mwah.